this is uh, the scanning plan of the uh, video study patient aged 40 years lying in left lateral decubitus posture with probe in the intercostal space moving this is the subcostal region and these are the intercostal spaces so I will be uh, moving up just uh, three fingers or four fingers up in the intercostal space to show you the pathology and will uh, angle the probe straight or 90 degrees from here. So, so let's see what we get in this <coughs> uh, view from the ultrasound machine. Now if you concentrate a bit then this is the right diaphragm, this is the liver, normal and in the liver, in the anterior segment of the liver you see uh, cystic area, multi cystic area rather, well demarcated, this is the pathology, now this is, this is the magnified view, This is the 90 degree angle from the 90 degree angle. In the interior segment of the right row, we see a cystic area in which multiple cysts are present. Now, this is with multiple cysts with the net gives posterior wall sharp posterior wall shadowing as well. This is a cyst. It measures approximately 7.5 centimeters into 3.4 centimeters with this is the river this is the river and uh, this is the main cyst that measures approximately 7.2 into 3.4 centimeter. This is the main bulk of the cyst. This is a small part here. If you see, there are multiple cysts, this, this one, this one, this one, these small and medium size and then large, all type of cysts are present within this main cystic area, which gives posterior shadowing. And you know, this finding is consistent with what we study as a hydrated cyst, cyst within cyst. So you see daughter cyst within this cyst, or, uh, and it also gives a penguin sign appearance. If I show you in this way, in this section, then you can see that it gives a bangle sign appearance. Cyst within cyst. Variable size, non-communicating, giving and the cyst, giving posterior sharp, posterior shadowing, and uh, is seen in the uh, anterior segment of the 
the right group. This is the main cyst. And internally, you can see there are multiple cysts within it. So this is, and this is the sharp posterior shadow, making the liver fatty, whereas the liver is normal. So this is the cyst, civilian cyst, see. So this is a hydrated cyst in the anterior segment of the right flow of the liver. And it is at the visceral surface. You see that the liver is otherwise normal. You see the eco brightness of the liver in this area, and see the eco brightness behind the cyst. Behind the cyst appears as if, as, if, as if the liver is fatty, is bright, but in this brightness is due to the posterior shadowing from the cystic area. Normal current primary. They were otherwise as normal current primary pathogenicity. This is the portal vein. This is the portal vein. And this is the kidney. The columbus are like a This is the kidney normal. <coughs> this is the gallbladder. With portal vein, this is the gallbladder, this is the portal vein, and uh, you see the hepatic veins. These are the right and left portal veins. So, as such, the liver is normal, except that there is a cystic area seen in the anterior segment of the right room with cyst within the cyst. The columbus are like a This is the cyst within the cyst, the hydrated cyst. So this is our case of the day. This is not an abscess. within the cyst. So, <coughs> and note the, uh, this posterior wall acoustic enhancement from the cystic area. Thank you.